The SA-80 is the designation for the revolutionary family of assault weapons. On its introduction, it proved so accurate that the Army marksmanship tests had to be redesigned. SA-80A2 comprises the individual weapon and the light support weapon. These are the British Army's standard combat weapons. Made by Heckler & Koch, they fire NATO standard 5.56 by 45 mm ammunition. The SA-80 underslung grenade launcher system consists of a Heckler & Koch AG-36 40mm grenade launcher and EOTech holographic sight wedded to an iStec range drum. The UGL allows fire teams to deliver effective fragmenting munitions out to 350 metres. Advantages of the system are low recoil, ease of use, reduced ammunition weight and ability to have a chambered grenade at the ready whilst continuing to fire the SA-80. The Glock 17 Gen 4 pistol is much lighter than its predecessor Browning pistol and more accurate. It also has an increased magazine capacity of 17 by 9mm rounds compared to 13 rounds for the Browning. British snipers fulfil a vital and enduring role on the battlefield in terms of intelligence gathering, target identification and eliminating high value targets. The L11 5 Alpha 3 rifle, part of the Sniper System Improvement Programme, is a large calibre weapon which provides state-of-the-art telescopic day and night all-weather sights, increasing the sniper's effective range considerably. The first batch of SSIPs were deployed to Afghanistan in May 2008. Designed to achieve a first round hit at 600 metres and a rassing fire out to 1100 metres, Accuracy International's L96 sniper rifle has also been upgraded with a new by 3, 12 and times 50 sight and spotting scope. Manufactured by Accuracy International, the L11 5 Alpha 3 long range rifle fires an 8.59mm bullet which is heavier than the 7.62mm round of the L96 and less likely to be deflected over extremely long ranges. Other elements of the Sniper System Improvement Programme include night sights, spotting scopes, laser range finders and tripods. The Sharpshooter Rifle has improved the long range firepower available on the front line. The rifle fires a 7.62mm round and has enhanced accuracy of engagement during longer range firefights. This weapon is used by some of the best shots in the infantry. More than 400 semi-automatic sharpshooter rifles were purchased for British troops as a £1.5 million urgent operational requirement. The sharpshooter complements the already potent range of weapons used by our forces. The L16 Alpha 2 81mm mortar is a battle group level indirect fire weapon which is capable of providing accurate, high explosive smoke and illuminating rounds out to a maximum range of 5,650 metres. The mortar platoon in mechanised and armoured infantry battalions are mounted in and fire from armoured personnel carriers, increasing mobility and enabling rapid disengagement and movement to new fire positions. The combat shotgun is a semi-automatic, tubular, magazine-fed weapon cambered for the 12-gauge cartridge. The operating system is the Argo, auto-regulated gas-operated twin two-gas piston system with a rotating bolt head and dual locking lugs. It is fitted with an EOT tech sight for use day or night and a fixed iron sight. It has a telescopic buttstock. It can be fired from the conventional fire positions except the squatting position. The L7 Alpha 2 General Purpose Machine Gun GPMG is a 7.62mm by 51mm belt-fed general purpose machine gun which can be used as a light weapon and in a sustained fire roll. In the SF roll, sustained fire roll, mounted on a tripod and fitted with a C2 optical sight, it is fired by a two-man team who are grouped in a specialist machine gun platoon to provide battalion level fire support. In SF mode, the GPMG with a two-man crew lays down 750 rounds per minute at ranges up to 1,800 metres. The GPMG can be carried by foot soldiers and employed as a light machine gun. A 
the fold-out bipod is used to support the GPMG in the LMG role. Versions of the GPMG are mounted on most army vehicles and some helicopters. The Heckler & Koch 40mm grenade machine gun provides unrivaled infantry suppression, combining the best characteristics of the heavy machine guns or light mortars usually employed in this role. Conventional rifle ammunition provides no fragmentation effect and is largely not effective enough against advancing armoured infantry fighting vehicles and battle tanks. On the other hand, mortars have the disadvantage of a relatively low rate of fire. The GMG combines the advantages of both these two types of weapons, delivering high flexibility and firepower combined with a fragmentation effect of mortar ammunition. The GMG is usually mounted on WIMIC, weapons mount installation kit, Land Rovers, but can also be used from the ground based tripods. The powerful L1 Alpha 1 50 cal machine gun is an updated version of the Browning M2 50 cal, recognised as one of the finest heavy machine guns ever deployed. The HMG provides integral close range support from a ground mount tripod or fitted to a Land Rover using the WIMIC and a variety of sighting systems. The performance of HMG has recently been enhanced with a new soft mount to limit recoil and improve accuracy and a quick change barrel. The HMG provides a commander with added capability at greater ranges 1500 to 2000 meters when support from armoured vehicles is not available. Guided weapons features. The Javelin anti-tank weapon, which is primarily designed to destroy tanks and light armoured vehicles, and the next generation light anti-tank weapon, a short range, easy to use missile that strikes tanks from above. Javelin, the medium range anti-tank guided weapon replacement for Milan, is an enhanced version of the American weapon proven on operations in Iraq and Afghanistan by US forces. Although designed primarily to destroy tanks and light armoured vehicles, Javelin will also provide a potent, all-weather, day or night capability against fixed defences such as bunkers and buildings. The integrated sight allows the operator to acquire the target, lock on, fire and forget. This means that as soon as the missile is launched, the firer can acquire another target or move position. Javelin has a maximum range of 2,500 metres, an overfly and direct attack mode of operation. Javelin is a crew-served weapon operated by a firer and a controller observer. The controller observer commands the weapon and assists with loading, identifying targets and battlefield damage assessment. The next generation light anti-tank weapon, NLAW, is the first non-expert, short-range, anti-tank missile that rapidly knocks out any main battle tank in just one shot by striking it from above. Enlaw utilises predicted line of sight guidance and has overfly top and direct attack modes and it is easy to use, making it a valuable tank destroyer for light forces that operate dismounted in all environments including built-up areas. It also has night vision capability and is designed for all climate conditions and environments.